Oh, is this your hyoid bone? That's how you can tell who murdered who. Like, when the hyoid bone breaks and how it breaks. I learned that in anatomy and physiology. When I'm in the Hamptons, I don't always get a chance to show off who the real Sierra Miller is. Only my inner circle really knows the ins and outs of my life before TV. Today, DirecTV is putting my real life skills to the test. And if you didn't know, I'm a nurse in the ICU. And I see you. This is more than a pop quiz. I'm the real deal, if I do say so myself. So let's see how many bones I can actually name. I'm gonna pull him on over here. I'm gonna name him Stuart. All right, Stuart. Obviously, we have a skull. We have the sternum. We have the xiphoid process. We have the clavicle, midclavicular, basically your armpit, your humerus. This is the ilium. This is the pubis pubic symphysis, cervical vertebrae, your thoracic, your lumbar vertebrae. I've named a few bones, so let's switch gears. I'm gonna move to some organs. Your liver sits here. I'm gonna talk about the liver for a second because it's probably one of my favorite organs. And it's actually the only organ that can really regenerate itself back to 100% or normal size. Put that six pack back on that table. Oh. All right, Stuart, I've had enough of you. The hardest part about being on reality TV and a nurse and in the modeling realm would probably be trying to, one, juggle all of them. Two, I feel like it's hard for me to be in the hospital at this point in my career because I never want the attention to be taken away from the patient. I really do believe it's a collaborating team. We all play such an important role in the hospital and sometimes me being on TV is a distraction. But the exciting thing about it is that there's so many different avenues that you can do with nursing. There's aesthetics, there's integrative health, there's like preventative medicine. There's just so many different fields that I'm excited to explore. That's kind of where my future of nursing will land. Having some type of medical knowledge is so freaking important and so vital. I think it's pivotal in emergency situations and even just in your own health, it helps you advocate for yourself. And when you're advocating for yourself, doctors are more likely to take you seriously. They wanna educate you. They want you to know what's going on. They wanna make you a part of your own care. And you know, that's how you get the best possible health outcome. Wanna see more stars like me keeping it real? Stay tuned for more Reality TV is Real from the DirecTV studio.